All right, uh, Sam, we're doing some Jacktober today, huh? Yes, we are. Who are we featuring? Let me do the psych. Let me do the official sweeper first. Happy Jacktober, everybody! From your friends at the Opie and Anthony Show. It's a celebration of hacky, pukey radio shows and DJs from across this great nation of ours. Be aware out there today that there seems to be something in the air besides the fall weather here. (laughs) Oh, my God. Would you just kill yourself? (laughs) I I would uh, go home and just swallow a shotgun. Wake up the crapola. It's Jocktober. There's a person stranded. There's a show. There's a show. (laughs) It's stranded. (laughs) I love that. That is fun. (laughs) (laughs) What the hell was that? Happy Jocktober, everybody, from your friends at the L.P. and Anthony Show. Ha ha. Let's all do it. Ha 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 ha. There was no joy attached to that sound. None. Hey, uh, so we feature Lander in the morning. Yeah. Lander in the morning. He's he's an example of a guy that uh, probably should have retired. How many years ago? About 20. About 20? Looks like... Paul McCartney in this picture. Radio guys got to know when to retire, and um, John Lander's one of these guys. He used to be pretty good, huh? Stump Brain, I, I, I do remember he used to work here in New York City. At one I, time, he was the highest-paid DJ in America. In America? And he was on Oprah's show as the highest-paid DJ. Had a 20 share in the morning in Houston. Wow. We had a 30 share in Cleveland. Wow. We didn't get no TV coverage for that. <laughs> no. We got TV coverage for other things. Oh yeah, that's why <laughs> we, we had a something like a thirty, like a thirty-five share in Cleveland, wow. and then a couple weeks later we had no jobs. That's how we roll. We had a no share. <laughs> that's how we roll. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's how we blow things. That's up. That's right. So Lander in the morning, he's uh, he's hacking it up at mix, huh? Yeah, he's kind of a woman. What do you mean? <laughs> like he's very. I don't know. He sounds like Feminine. a woman. Yeah. Really? Yeah. Like the, the You used to have a really good radio voice, right, Stump Brain? Yeah. He had one of those smooth deliveries. I think he's trying to go young. Like he's trying to because he's on a mix station. Yeah. And they're playing a lot of like young teen hits. Every city has a mix station, so. All right, here we go. John Lander. Lander in the morning with Kelly Malone and Alicia Love. Alicia's a stand up, huh? Yes, Alicia is their uh, is their stand up. Is she oh. a hold too? Well, I mean, I, you guys be the judge. I'm not here to judge. I'm just here to... All right. Well, Lander uh, wakes up in the morning with Jessica. They talk Halloween. Ooh, I like mm-hmm. Halloween. Yeah. Do you, Sam? I love Halloween. <laughs> Hi. Good morning, Mixed All right. First of all... <laughs> Whoa. What are they... He's, he's wanch- 60 wanch- wanch- something. <laughs> yeah. Hi. Hey, good morning. Hi. Hey. Hi, good morning, Mix 98.5. Who's this? This is Jessica. Jessica, let's all wake up together. Let's all... Oh, 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 oh jeez. All right, and let's not snap a bra strap or something here. Hey. Easy. What did that mean? Yeah, what does that mean, Sam? Because, you, you know... study this stuff. What does that mean? You're all stretching in the morning. Go, whoa, don't stretch too much. Yo. So if she's a booby monster and she's stretching, she might pop a, she might pop a bra a, strap? Yeah, but most women don't sleep with their bras on. So. Yeah. Maybe they put it on their bras and then well, they if you're stretch. Stretch. If you were sleeping with John Lander, you would sleep with your bra on, your winter coat, everything. Yeah. Steve a snow from, suit. Steve from Bayshore has already got a new name for the show, Blander in the, <laughs> in the Boring. Blander in the Boring. Nice. Hey, let's not snap a bra strap or something here. Hey, what's up with Jessica? Uh, that's funny. Uh, I'm on my way to work. Yeah. Oh, you sound absolutely thrilled. I am. What are you going to be for Halloween? You didn't declare. Uh, I don't think I'm going to dress up. I, I, I got a monkey costume for my son. That'll be good for him. <laughs> also known as the... Yeah. Uh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> Enough said. <laughs> I got a monkey costume for my son. That'll be good for him. Oh, <laughs> you're good. Gonna for yourself. <laughs> oh, God. Did you hear the wait, hole? Wait, what? She said good for you? She goes, I, I think it was either... Uh, that or ah, oh, cute. Yeah, like, there's two of them. So one came wow. in with the ah, cute, and the other one what? said, "I thought it. I thought it was gonna. You were gonna say for you, not for your kid, but for you. Oh, what's, that would just be silly. What's yeah. cute about a monkey costume? You see a little kid. He's monkeys probably, are cute. Uh, not really. You know, not. We had that adorable. dumb monkey in. 
That was cute. No, that little, what was his name? Mikey. 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 Mikey wasn't cute. Mikey was adorable. <laughs> Mikey was too old for his diaper. Oh. What? Yeah, he had a diaper Mikey on. did smell a little bad. Yeah, but, he did. But it wasn't Mikey cute. Mikey would hold your hand. Yeah. And was, like look at you with the little monkey eyes. It was cute. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I don't think I'm going to dress up. I'm, I'm, I got a monkey costume for my son. That'll be good for him. Oh, <laughs> you good. See for yourself. <laughs> <laughs> So why, why is laugh? it funny? Because she laugh? said it's for my son, and then someone said, "Well, we thought it might be for you," and then Lander laughs at that <laughs> in this weird high pitch. <laughs> yeah. You're right; it is very feminine. Yeah. His voice sounds very Does feminine. He have, is he doing hormones or something? Yeah, maybe he's, probably. Maybe while he's wearing bras, apparently. Oh, oh, good. Good. See for yourself. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, I've decided uh, I'm going to be a pimple. What? Oh, yeah? yeah? How do you do that? Well, I'm not going to declare. I'm not going to say yet. Are you going to be, like, all red and then spit white stuff out? I mean, well, <laughs> you, you'll have to squeeze something. You know? No! Yeah. You have to. Well, I mean, you do oh, that. Man. I mean, right? Why is he being. No! Uh, all right, I, I'm getting the vibe already because uh, he was on here in New York and he was very safe and, like, kind of morning zooish, right? Yeah. Yeah. He's, he's like, dirty old man jock. Yeah. You're going to have to squeeze yeah, something. Yeah, you're going to have to squeeze something. Very creepy. Yes. No! <laughs> <laughs> oh! Ugh. The holes are always the same. It's just That's a good the sign. same mold. Now there's no one working on the phones. What does that mean? They gave up. All right. They just ran out of the building. They're, they're on break. People <laughs> they're on break. Do people realize what would happen if we just gave up? Well, Stop yeah. giving up around us. We haven't. Where? Yeah, why is the name? Oh, here's Tim. Oh, oh, oh that's boy. good. Oh, <laughs> oh no. Wires. There's a, a new guy. Yeah. Apparently, a man cow had walked in. He's <laughs> helping him out. Look, he's just nodding. Uh huh. Yes. Uh huh. Yeah. Tim is yeah. explaining the uh -huh. uh, the problem through his alcoholism. <laughs> oh, <laughs> this guy is. Yeah, there you go. This guy is, uh, you know, the suit guy going, uh huh, uh huh. Uh -huh. Steve, what do we know on the phones? I see we brought in the, the heavy hitter here. Yeah, we uh, got a heavy hitter in here. They're, that cable that they're holding in their hand, apparently, it's been, uh, you know, like it's had like a short in it for some time. Oh. And it's connected to a device that is right in here by you. So the the quick alternative is to find a very long cable that reaches from Travis's room all the way in here. Great. A Cat 5? Great. Yeah. Is that what they're looking for? Yeah. Great. Yeah. I'm in high school again trying to get my car to work so I can drive yeah. to school. Great. Yeah. That's, what, that's what they got going on. Or They're using cable. jumper cables in nice. the house. Yeah. Fix the phones. All right. Uh, Lander and the gang do the list of bad candy bit. We did that, Sam. Yeah, remember when Kevin Smith was in and you guys yeah. were all talking? And remember mm -hmm. I said how hacky and awful this was and I ran through it really fast and well, acknowledged that it's just a bad radio bit? They didn't go, like, they spent a little more time on it. Yeah. I just brought a couple clips in, though, because I wanted to, you know, say that we're not the only ones doing that stuff. Mm -hmm. All right. Lander in the morning up there in Boston. The candy you hate to get for Halloween as trick-or-treaters. Mm -hmm. And what were some of the items? Well, uh, Laffy Taffy, which hey. I guess gets stuck in your teeth. He did this. I don't know. I yeah. like Laffy Taffy. I don't know. I never like Tootsie Rolls. Oh, then this is candy that you hate to get. All Tootsie right. Rolls is number seven. Yeah, mm -hmm. I bet. I like number eight, miscellaneous wrapped hard candy. Yeah, oh, you know gosh. where they just have that generic packaging yeah, on it, it? And they literally last for about two seconds when you put them in your mouth. Dum Dum Lollipop. This is what it's like <laughs> to listen to girls talk about tampons. Yes. Why? 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 That would be more interesting, to tell you the truth. Uh -oh. It's just like when Kevin Smith was in. Here comes the big wire. All right. The wire is going to be run from Opie. This is exciting. All right. I wish we were taping. Mm -hmm. Where's the wire go? We have to make sure that it works for Oh, they oh, have to make sure, have to it, make works sure it works All right. Take your time. Yeah, don't worry about don't it. Don't worry about it. Phones are just ringing off the hook. Yeah. <laughs> you can't answer them. It's wonderful. Literally lasts for about two seconds when you put them in your mouth. Dum Dum Lollipops. Yeah, those are They dumb. describe them as the red-headed stepchild of lollipops. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's <laughs> dumb, dumb. Uh, <laughs> Good gravy. <laughs> Dumb, dumb lollipops. That's wonderful. Yeah. It's very funny, though, because, you know, like a redheaded stepchild is sort of the one that's more ignored or liked less. <laughs> is that it, yeah. uh, Sam? Good. Thank, thank you for that. Yeah. Mm. But it's a lollipop. It's not a kid. Yeah. Duh. Why do we have more audio from the list of bad candy bits? <laughs> because. Didn't we're, we do enough with that? No. We, you know, we did some. They did some. And. It's time for the listeners to judge for themselves as to who's better. Uh, but good news, uh, Lander and the gang end the bad candy bit with a hammering punchline. Yeah. <laughs> oh. 
You got to end on a laugh. You know what I mean? Call me crazy, but I think it's not going to be hammering, huh? I guess it's a matter of <laughs> opinion, but a complete lack of hammering is right.